Hello and welcome. My name is Bailey Moss, and in today's video, I will demonstrate how Documents Court Pack helps simplify quote generation and delivery within Dynamics 365 and Power Apps. So first thing I'm going to do is go ahead and open up my demo instance, which is going to be the Sales Hub within Dynamics 365 Unified Interface. From there, I'm going to navigate to my quotes. And these documents can be triggered via the view or a single record. So I'm going to go ahead and open a single active quote record. Um, from there, you'll notice on the ribbon, we have a create document button, which is a part of documents core pack. As soon as that's clicked, it'll show a list of one click actions that are available. Um, so one click actions are predefined option sets for document creation and delivery, whether it's being saved to SharePoint, attached to an email, attached to a note, or just generated as a temp file. Um, so in this case, I'll go ahead and use my send quote as PDF. What this one click action is defined to do is generate a quote as PDF, attach it to an email, use a separate documents core pack template to fill in the email content and set as a draft email. It can also be set to send automatically. Additionally, there's a preview and review step that can be skipped. Um, but in this case, I've set it. So you have the option to edit. Um, edit and review. So if you want to make small changes to the document before it's sent, such as personalization, contract amendments, you can set that up in the process as well or skip. So I'm going to go ahead and hit finish. And what this will do is open up a draft email record. Um, and it should have my document attached as PDF and also the email content fulfilled. So what you can see here is it's got my quote attached, setting the name dynamically of the quote and it's brought in all the information from the quote as well as related records. So it's going to the um, customer information, so Coho Winery, the quote number, created on date, quote record, uh, one to many relationship of the quote products, and so and also the quote total, um, and then static text as well as valid two info, um, and it's all set as a P and it's saved as a PDF as well. Additionally, on the email record, it brings in the from dynamically, the to dynamically, the subject, which is set in the template, and the email content, which is a separate template that you can set or make selectable. Um, so in this case, it's bringing in the primary contact's first name, the quote number, and the signature dynamically. Additionally, besides using the one-click actions, you can also automate this process via Power Automate Flow or Dynamics Workflow. So to give you an idea of what that looks like, I'll go ahead and open up Power Automate. And from here, I'll go to My Flows. And this is just a simple example I created based on quote activation. So as soon as the quote is set to active, it will trigger this flow. And what you'll notice is this is only a single trigger, of course, because it's limited to a single trigger, and only seven actions to, to create and send this quote, same as the one-click action. So what this is doing is getting the quote record, creating the email, creating the email content, adding the email content to the email, creating the quote, attaching the quote, and sending. And it's as simple as that. My contact information along with a link to our website and free trial information can be found in the description below. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out. And thank you for watching.